I made a massive mistake. I put it in the wrong hole. I'll tell you what I mean after the intro. Afternoon guys and welcome back to the channel and for the first time in my office. So welcome, this is where I do all of my work. But why am I in my office and what about that weird intro around wrong holes? Where was your mind going with that one by the way? Well let me tell you but first let me apologise. I do sound a bit groggy because I've got Covid at the moment. A couple of my sons have also got it but we've all got it pretty mildly so hopefully we just get over it pretty quickly. But last week I made a trip down to Corfe Castle in Dorset for sunrise. The forecast was for very misty and foggy conditions and anybody that knows that location knows that it is at its best if it's shrouded in those conditions. It involved a very early start, half past one I had to get up in order to get there in time, it takes me about two and a half hours to get there. And when I got there the conditions looked amazing, I was really excited and started setting up my equipment in the dark and this is where I made that kind of cardinal mistake if you like. I put the jack for the microphone in the headphone jack on my camera rather than the microphone jack in my camera which meant that my head my microphone did not pick up any of the sound did not record any of the audio and the microphone built into my camera recorded all of the sound and it doesn't matter what camera you've got how good how professional it is all of the microphones built into those cameras are not very good so what i've ended up with is a bunch of video clips where I'm talking and the audio is just not usable and it's not of a quality that I'm prepared to show you guys and therefore what I've decided to do is actually I'm going to create this video and let the visual side of things do the talking for me. So I'm going to show you a bunch of video clips, time lapses, some still images, some drone footage and some time lapses from my GoPro Hero 10 and let that tell the story of the morning and Hopefully it'll do justice to just how amazing that morning was. I will check in at the end of the video, but please, if you do enjoy this style of video, it's something a little bit different for me, but if you enjoy this video, please drop a comment. It does help me, but I really, really value the feedback that you guys give me because it then helps me kind of, and guides me around what kind of videos to make for the future. So I will check in again, I will see you again, but for now, enjoy the video.
Well, I hope you enjoyed that, guys. It was an absolute privilege to be there, to watch the mist change and rise as the darkness turned into light, and then when the sun came over the East Hill and you know, cast that kind of golden light on the mist and it all lit up and the shadows that came from Corf Castle as a result of the sun hitting the back of it was just an absolute privilege to be there and I thoroughly enjoyed it along with 15 other photographers that were there at the time. I wanted to take this opportunity to tell you about a new website that I've just released which is going to be linked here and also I'll leave the link in the description below. The address is www.jodiespoonerphotographyandvideo.com. It's obviously going to be a place for me to showcase some of my more successful work, but also I'm hoping to build a community on there. And what I'm going to include is location guides to help people kind of go and visit some of the nice places that I've visited and just a bit of information about when is the right time to go there. Should it be a sunrise location or a sunset? And also... I'm in the process of setting up a new group, which is going to be called the F8 Photography Academy, which is going to be a really exciting new project that I'm putting together that I'm going to be able to tell you guys more about in the near future. But if you do get a chance, go and check that out. Um, I've got a blog in there, a few other bits and pieces. I'm really proud of how it looks at the moment, but I will continue to evolve that as we move through, uh, through the journey. Anyway, I'm going to end the video here. If you've enjoyed this video, please give the video a like. Again, really interested to get any of your feedback. So any comments you want to give, constructive, positive, try not to be negative, but if you feel negative, then, you know, go ahead. Then, uh, yeah, I'm really interested to hear your feedback. And yeah, thank you for watching. And until the next one, bye for now.